Dance Pa, aka Katie, and I am here in HD. Ta-da! So, this is an update video, and what can I tell you? I can tell you that uh, the month of May was probably one of the warmest uh, months of May we've had um, in a century, and so that meant I got outdoors a lot and was taking a lot of photos and taking advantage of the sunshine and the warm weather, and uh, so I took literally hundreds, if not thousands, of photos in the month of May, and uh, that's very normal for me. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to show you some of um, some of my favorite shots from the month of May right now. Solid tech. <laughs> Just. Dig that St. Louis floating by. We now are approaching New Port Rhode Island. We've been for years in variety. Charlie Nickelback, but now we're going to be in high, high, high society, high society. Yes, I wanna play for my former pal. Who runs the local jazz festival? His name is Dexter, and he's good news. But something kind of tell me that boy is nice in the blues. And I, I, I society, I society, I society, I, I, I society, I society. Yes, he's got the blues because his former wife begins tomorrow. Uh, yes, yeah, so um, along with the warm weather means that I have been outdoors doing yard work. Because uh, you, for those of you who have been around for a while, you will know I like to do yard work. Yes, uh, <laughs> I don't know why. I just like it. Okay. Um, so some of you will know that my parents sold a family home and moved into a granny suite, a brand new basement apartment in my brother and sister-in-law's brand new home. And so it's a beautiful basement apartment, but the, the, their yard is nothing but gravel and rocks. And uh, so my mom wanted, um, you know, maybe if I was available, could I do something to like help beautify the area. So I'm turning in two um, major sections, two like eight by uh, 12 or eight by 10 foot sections um, into what will eventually be um, gardens for her full of perennials and the and the odd annuals and um, so I started that project which required a lot of raking and a lot of weeding and then I had to find rocks to uh, make a border around the garden area anyways so the next few pictures you're gonna see is uh, my efforts at raking and weeding and and trying to turn this this bit of uh, dusty dirt <laughs> into something like a garden. Anyway, so I'll show you uh, the sum of the landscaping now. New life, she started lately, a new affair, and now the silly chick is gonna marry a square. And I, 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 I'm so sad, square to do it. This is cement paint, and um, I'm gonna use it to paint this wall over here, you see. Once I paint the wall, I can get started on the garden, which is going to go in this big area. Nothing but dirt right now. <laughs> so uh, this, what looks like um, blue or greenish paint, is um, actually a, a sealant that uh, goes on the cement or the basement wall. And um, you'll see that there are these patterns of white swirls or whatever. That was glue that was put on afterwards and then there was styrofoam which you can see here that was put on the wall and this is all to protect the uh, basement apartment from leaking and that sort of thing. It's it's typical uh, nowadays of new homes and uh, but anyways we've taken off the uh, styrofoam and uh, I scraped off most of the glue. Uh, now I'm going to wipe the wall down um, with a dry cloth to get rid of any dirt, cobwebs, bugs, and, uh, and then I'm going to paint. Okay, so here is the first coat of paint that's gone on. I don't know whether or not we're going to do a second coat, but um, here's this job as it is. Doesn't look very good. Looks like there's a couple spots that could use a little going over, but oh well, it's just a cement wall, right people? Oh, there we go. Hi. 
as I as society. But brother Dexter, just trust your such to stop that wedding and kill that match. I took much of it and stop the fun. Play in such a way that you come back to your son. And I yeah, so that's a landscaping project. The next project is um, I am going to be house sitting for my brother and sister in law. Not the ones. <laughs> Not the ones who live above my parents, but the ones who live in this house right here where I'm standing. And uh, they're going away on vacation, family vacation, down to uh, New Hampshire. And um, so they'll be gone for a week, and so I'm going to take care of the cat and take care of the house. So I'll have a week to myself. Yeah, I'm so excited. So, in other news, my sister and I went to the movies, and uh, we saw Snow White and the Huntsman. And the two of us totally fell in love with that movie. Yeah! <laughs> so it's a it's a dark version of um, of the Snow White story. Um, it uses the, the the plot and many of the same characters that we know from the story, but of course, it's it's made it its own, right? Like the new Alice in Wonderland kind of deal. So it is its own story. Very interesting. It has the most fantastic CGI people. It has these incredible and beautiful scenes that I love. Someone had a fantastic imagination and they totally brought it to life there. It's really, really cool. For me, visually, it is a super cool movie. Um, does it have like a really in-depth plot? No. Does it have like really deep characters? No, not really. <laughs> you know, some of them are. Uh, they, they, the queen, who's quite wicked, um, they give her a great backstory. So, you know, I don't know that you're going to feel sorry for her, but it at least explains her wickedness in a way that, you know, the story of Snow White doesn't explain, so. And uh, they just made her out to be super vain, and in here, it's not that she's vain, it's something else that's going on, so. Anyways, all I'm saying is, it's a really good movie, it is dark, it is gruesome, you know, and uh, so it's not for everybody, uh, especially people who are sensitive to that sort of thing, and, uh, but uh, I enjoyed it, so, and my sister Carrie loved it too, so we were two very happy campers. It was money well spent. Yeah! Alright folks, that's, uh, that's it for now, I guess, and uh, I'll chit-chat with you all later. Bye. 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 Bye.